video clip just to show um, how the antenna needs to be fitted on the boat for it to, to work effectively. Essentially, all of this is not antenna. This is just a steel whip. The antenna is that little piece at the end of the antenna, just like that. So to connect that element down to the micro connector that's built into the bottom of, of the base inside there is a cable. Um, you can see on, on this side, on the, on the base part, that it's really a miniature connector built into a stainless steel bolt to give it strength. Uh, but in essence, a little pin that's less than a millimeter in diameter is sort of dropped two millimeters, one and a half millimeters into that pin. And it all happens when the antenna is fully screwed down. Now, we've seen people start like this and then they start screwing the antenna and it, it goes on and might cross thread and it feels tight. But, it, but, it, but it's actually cross-thread and it never reaches that connector. So the idea is to hold it vertically with your left hand and to spin it gently with your right hand at the base like that, making sure that it goes all the way down and you'll know that it's right when it seats, when the antenna actually stops and seats on that base. I think my activity in the beginning... Okay, I partially caught the thread okay but you can see that when it's correct it basically goes down and it seats and seals the base antenna on there and at that point that little pin has just dropped in it's only a two millimeter long pin if that um, once it's in then you can do what you like with the antenna the pin doesn't move and it's a solid connection um, but if it if it doesn't reach the bottom if you don't get it now you don't take it and tighten it like that you just use two fingers and you tweak it up so that you can get it off just as easily with two fingers. That's all that you do. Overdoing it will tear the boot, dislodge the insides. But once it's on like that, it's strong and you will have it. It can bend right around the boat, actually. It's no problem. Um, so that is just the correct way to fit the antenna. And I hope that's helpful.